amid constant changes in our surroundings, some things remain unchanged. The reality is that, regardless of the era, every man should be able to protect himself and face adversities. And for that, there are certain essential skills that every man should master to tackle life's challenges. Some people might watch this video and think it's promoting division or controversy, which is understandable, considering the current context of a crisis involving fragility in many men today. However, the purpose of this content is quite the opposite, to empower and strengthen. Just watch the video until the end to understand the true message. That's why we're going to talk about seven essential skills that were mandatory for men in the past and that remain relevant today. Before we start, make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave a uh, like. It helps us a lot and costs you nothing. Let's go. Number one, the ability to defuse conflicts. Being able to defuse conflicts is an essential skill in any context. This involves noticing tone of voice, body language, and other non-verbal cues that may suggest tension or aggression. Instead of reacting with hostility or defensiveness, someone skilled in the art of defusing conflicts uses diplomacy and assertive communication to calm the situation. Actively listening, acknowledging others' concerns, and finding common ground are actions that turn potential confrontations into opportunities to build trust and mutual respect. This skill is particularly valuable for those aspiring to lead. An effective leader is not just someone who commands or gives orders, but someone who can maintain harmony and promote collaboration within a group, even in times of crisis. Imagine a workplace where disagreements are frequent. The true leader is the one who intervenes calmly and clearly, defusing the conflict and guiding everyone toward a positive solution. This leader is seen as an anchor of stability, someone people trust to maintain order and respect. The ability to defuse conflicts also reflects a high level of self-control and confidence. Those who master this skill do not need to resort to intimidation or violence to assert authority. Their presence alone is enough to positively influence the environment. Just like the alpha male among gorillas, who keeps others in line, not through aggression, but through the respect his presence commands. Similarly, a man who knows how to defuse conflicts naturally exudes confidence and authority. To develop this skill, it's also important to understand the concept of being prepared to protect yourself and others if necessary. This balance between resolving issues peacefully and being ready to act assertively when needed is what makes the ability to defuse conflicts truly powerful. This does not imply being aggressive, but rather having an awareness of your own abilities and knowing how to use them ethically and in a controlled manner. Number two, having a strong presence. Having a strong presence is a characteristic that does not go unnoticed. Some men seem to naturally command respect as soon as they enter a room, without needing to say a word. This skill is not a supernatural gift, but something that can be learned and developed a strong presence is the result of many habits and attitudes accumulated over time, such as a firm handshake, maintaining eye contact during conversations, and walking with confident posture. Presence is not something that can be faked. People can tell when someone is being authentic or when they are trying to impose an image. Men who try to force these traits by shaking hands too hard or staring at people to intimidate them, often come across as imposters. The best way to learn how to have a strong presence is by observing men who already master this skill, whether they are mentors, family members, or other close examples. True presence is a combination of respect, confidence, and authenticity. Number three, deep critical thinking. Critical thinking is a skill that goes beyond simply analyzing information. 
It involves questioning your own assumptions and being willing to consider multiple perspectives. In a world saturated with information and opinions, being able to think critically and independently is an invaluable advantage. This not only improves your decision-making ability, but also enriches your conversations and broadens your understanding of the world around you. The first step to developing critical thinking is to be open to new ideas and willing to challenge what you believe to be true. It's not just about accepting or rejecting what is said, but about examining arguments, exploring evidence, and being willing to change your mind when confronted with new information. This is a skill that can lead to a richer life and more informed decisions. Number four, being good with your money. One of the most significant gaps in formal education is the lack of personal finance teaching. Many men go through life without understanding how to manage money, invest wisely, or plan for their financial future. We are often taught that the goal is to get a stable job with a good salary, but that is just part of the equation. A healthy financial mindset involves knowing how to spend, save, and invest intelligently. Being good with your money isn't just about earning more, it's about making what you earn work for you. This may include learning about investments like stocks and real estate, understanding the impact of compound interest, and developing a strategy to achieve financial independence. It's crucial to start educating yourself financially as early as possible to avoid common mistakes like excessive debt and lack of retirement planning. Number five, knowing how to defend yourself. Knowing how to defend yourself is an essential skill that goes beyond physical combat. It involves being prepared to protect yourself and others in various situations, such as making quick decisions in dangerous moments, knowing how to avoid or de-escalate conflicts, and acting strategically to ensure safety. In a society where security is often a concern, having the confidence that you can defend yourself is vital. Imagine being in a situation where your safety or that of a loved one is threatened. It's not just about physical strength, but being mentally prepared to act sensibly and responsibly. The ability to defend yourself is linked to situational awareness, knowledge of self-defense techniques, and the skill to think quickly under pressure. Number six, learning to manage stress. How you handle stress can define your success and your ability to face challenges. Stress is a part of life, and learning to manage it effectively is a skill that can improve your quality of life and relationships. Many stress-related problems stem from habits like procrastination, lack of organization, and unclear priorities. Developing strategies to better manage your time and tasks can help alleviate stress and make daily life more manageable. To manage stress, it's important to create a routine that includes moments of rest, physical activities, and relaxation techniques like meditation or deep breathing. Setting boundaries and learning to say no are also fundamental aspects of avoiding an overload of responsibilities that can cause burnout. Remember that while stress is inevitable, you have the power to choose how you will respond to it and turn it into a motivating force. Number seven, being resilient. Resilience is the ability to quickly recover from challenges and adversity. This skill is crucial for everyone, but especially for men who often face additional pressures to remain strong and overcome obstacles. Being resilient means not just enduring hardships, but also learning from them and using those lessons to grow. Resilience isn't about ignoring problems. It's about facing adversity with a positive and adaptive mindset. It means learning from mistakes, adjusting strategies as needed, and moving forward even when things seem insurmountable. To cultivate resilience, it's helpful to develop a strong sense of purpose, maintain a support network, and recognize your own achievements, no matter how small. Thanks for watching until the end. If you made it this far, leave Armored Wisdom in the comments to show you're part of this journey. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, now's the time. See you soon.